Hello? Yay! Hello, hello! <laughs> there was one thing I forgot to get back in order after I was, uh... After I was restarting my computer so much today, trying to get stuff to work. Chat does look different. I am now using OBS instead of Streamlabs. So now you get, like, boxes uh, <laughs> until I can get a... Uh... I'm really hoping... I'm really hoping that I can get a custom chat overlay at some point. That'd be really freaking cool. But it's not gonna be today. Um, so now your boxes. <laughs> You're all trapped in my chat. <laughs> yes. <laughs> We're sharing the brain cell, Mopey. That's probably not good. Um, welcome in, Bryant and Frankie, Reeb, uh, and me. Uh, if you direct your attention to the bottom left corner of the screen, you will see that my heart rate monitor came in. So, I figure, so Five Nights at Freddy's isn't going to be in for a little bit, but I figured what I could do is I could test it on Day of the Diver where things occasionally get very spoopy. Uh-oh, why is it eliminating my chat? I don't want it to do that. I will have to go in um and and fix that so that chat doesn't disappear i need you i need you there <laughs> trapped in tunnels domain expansion oh no but okay you know how i've mentioned i i know i'm waffling before we get started but you know how i've mentioned before that like my heart rate can get really low if i just like exist all right watch this all right deep breaths as it gets higher. Ta-da! I swear I'm not dying. That is literally just my resting heart rate. <laughs> oh, God. Your heart rate does that too! Yeah, I just have to sit still for like ever so slightly and my heart rate is like, would you like to die? No, no, I would not actually. Thank you very much. Thank you for asking. <laughs> Twilight turning into a vampire. I mean, I want to call myself a vampire. Oh, wait, that didn't doc. Hey, doc, doc, doc. Hey, chat. All right, I guess you just float. All right, well, whatever. Um, <laughs> welcome in, Ninja. How are you? Twilight exists. Twilight, it's been a good run. It's it's really bad. It's so bad. I mean, it's good, but it's bad. Vampires, <laughs> no, come back. I promise I won't suck your blood. All right. Man, I have got to get better weapons. Duff. Can you help me? Duff, can you help me? All right, so we got the triple axle. Wait. Wait, did I want you to craft it or do I want you to upgrade it? Upgrade. There we go. There we go. The triple axle. Quattro axle. Quattro axle two? Yes. I do like shooting things. <laughs> Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Our Discord mod is at it again. Welcome in, Vanta Crew. How are you? <laughs> it's his magical girl transformation. Okay. Yeah. What's wrong with vampires? Vam Twire. Are you happy? You already got a badumptus like five minutes into stream. Okay, what are you buying and selling today, good sir? Waterproof box, oxygen, ammo refill. Uh, let me sell you some stuff. I got some good stuff. Some good stuff. Welcome in, Bryant. Hi, Avi. 
What about vampires? Vampire spawns? Oh dear. Oh no. We have summoned we have summoned the memory of of the game that Abby's been playing. The screen is frozen. What the frick? Oh no. Um Well shoot. Okay. I mean Okay. Why are you frozen? Why are you frozen? Hi, Diego. Welcome in. Currently trying to figure out why the heck my window capture is not capturing correctly. <gasps> okay. I actually have no idea what I just uh, clicked, but here we are. Oh, no. We missed the Discord mod. Ah! Okay, I knew there would be scuff. I knew there would be scuff because I, I switched I switched streaming software. I didn't expect it to be that type of scuff. Yeah, now it's working. Oh, I have to bring a narwhal up to the surface, but there aren't any nets. Okay, so I think I'm just waiting two days. No, I'm going down to the glacial area. All right. Glacial area it is. That was the first thing you heard was vampires. No, no, no. It was set to window capture. Um, I might actually be able to set it to game capture now. I don't know. I was doing I was doing what I could, um, trying to like make it. I was rushing. I was trying to. Co oh shit! I forgot about you. Um, I was rushing, trying to copy what I knew uh, my Streamlabs scenes were, and so yeah, I was expecting some things to go wrong. Ooh, a net gun. Where do I want my gun gun? I might want my gun gun. Okay. It's koala. Welcome in koala. I do have my water. Think I could dive without any water? I think not. I love this theme. Does this hurt me? No, it does not. Does this hurt me runs into it anyway, waiting to see? I'm looking for a baby manatee. And I think they said last time it would be around where the beluga whale was. So that's the direction we're going to take. Oh, these are angry. Why are you angry? I don't want I don't want two of you to hit me. Oh, you're a tough. You are tough. Very tough. Please stop. Why aren't you dying yet? Got it. All right. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now my heart rate goes up when I furiously punch buttons. <laughs> That's fun. This is fun. I like this. Just a silly little add-on. There we go. Alzenipterus. Whatever you say. Wait, this is too far. This is too far down. Um, do I shoot you or do I net you? I net you. Waptia fieldensis. Fieldensis. Hmm. Neat. A <laughs> whole koala. I should hope. I should hope it is a whole koala instead of like bits and pieces of a koala. That would be a bit disturbing. Let's let's not talk about parts of koala. <laughs> now we're the good sushi restaurant. Uh, we are going to have the best sushi. Oh. I, I saw sound waves. Because the game gave me a visual indicator that there were sound waves, not that I have synesthesia. Oh, this crying sound is... I should go to where the crying sound is coming from. You think? You think? Maybe that's what you should do? Just possibly? Salt. Game capture generally works better on OBS. That's what you use and it functions a bit better. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm just, I'm still trying to figure it out. I would say, I mean, I did get the stream working. That is a positive. I can sort out the, 
the hiccups and preferences for sure it is this is the uh the highest come on come back i'm sick of chasing you there you go this is the maximum the maximum uh upgrade an obs baby yeah streamlabs just kept doing such stupid shit while i was trying to get my stream started and i have told you before my plans for sir doggo's Fugi. um but the thing is streamlabs as it exists it doesn't seem to have <laughs> nice you'll be seeing that heart rate a lot like as soon as we come back down you'll you'll see it a lot <laughs> But, um, I don't, I didn't see a way for Streamlabs to do a reactive Fugi, but OBS does. Um, so it was a change that was going to have to happen eventually. And the fact that it decided that it didn't want to start my streams properly just made it a bit of an easier decision. While I still have time before I start my job on Monday, um, I'm, I've been trying to get software and everything that I would need to stream once I start my job, I wanted to have it ready. And that includes um, the stream deck with OBS, but there is a problem and one that I tried valiantly to fight uh, with over and over and over again today. Like I had to reset my, oh no. The interest was blocked after the baby went in. Okay, yes. <laughs> that thing's been there for a while, though. Remember when I tried to bring... I'm going to grab that. Oh, man. Okay, I probably needed the oxygen anyway. Remember when I had to... Uh, when I was trying to do this last stream and I just got super frustrated and gave up? <laughs> Looked like there was a reason. All right, it's open. Let's go inside. Yay! Go to a new region. What am I fighting? This suit almost matches with my hair. So swag. <laughs> yeah, I guess it kind of... It's about the same darkness without the... But like a slightly different hue, I think. Well, I mean, I guess now... Because... It was three rocks that I dropped to begin with, so I think I had to trigger the, the cutscene specifically. I'm fighting. Yes. Oh, boy. It's very pretty in here. I don't think I would ever go deep sea diving, but... I mean... I wouldn't mind diving somewhere like this. Looks scared. We need to calm it down. Like the turtle? Do we get a love on it? Oh! <gasps> We're petting a manatee! Hello! Hello, lovely little sea cow! Hello! Oh, yes, love me! Oh, up here. All right. There you go. Oh, now we get to pet the head! Oh. Yes. Ear. Well, you don't have ears, but if you did, I would be giving them scratches. Dive into your dreams or heart, probably dreams. <laughs> okay, it's calmed down a bit. Shall we head out? Oh, shit. Escort mission. Gun time. What did I say? Oh, a narwhal came through the opening. If I don't take care of it, the baby manatee won't come out. All right, good thing I upgraded this. Ow. Whew, shall we head out? I mean, after I take this back to the surface with me, yeah. Yay! Um, what's in the box? Oh, there's air. Thank goodness. I did get the sea unicorn. I'm a monster. Yeah, we're just gonna disassemble that. Four fragments, not bad. 
and restock our ammo because they gave it to us and I have my <sighs> there's a shark in here too I think I'm gonna have to take the shark down to get out of here you think huh ow well that is easy with a very powerful gun <laughs> murder okay i guess we can leave now oh well, yeah after i get the shark meat you think i'm just gonna leave it a <laughs> poor beagle oh poor beagle okay another gun to tear down yeah nah i like my multi-axle gun and then some bullets and some air because i don't know if it's gonna keep me going okay i was expecting a boss fight i will actually happily take enemies that i've already faced enemies they're fish they're fish <laughs> do you know how to get back get back safely to the village oh cute okay go to gumo all right so i might be able to find a mirror and see if the mirror takes me to the sea people village that would be very useful fish can catch these hands in my case bullets yeah they've never actually let me fight a fish with my bare hands it's always only been uh baseballs baseball bats golf clubs you know the usual <laughs> enemy spotted i need them i need to kill them so that i can flourish in my restaurant I have no selfish... Oh, yeah, squeaky toys, rubber chickens. <laughs> the usual. Please come back. Please come back. Please don't die to the poison. I want to catch you before that happens. Thank you. Oh, another narwhal. Shall I? I think I shall. Ow. Damn, that hurt. Did they just give me a very weak narwhal? It feels like they did. Whew. All right, and now I retreat because holy shit. <laughs> I'm hurt. I poison the fish and feed it to people. Don't ask questions, Dopey. Don't ask questions. I don't have an evil plan. Shh. <laughs> All right. To oh, four grade. Okay, to my father. <laughs> what? Oh, okay, okay, okay. I get it. Mother Twyla, is this why I feel funny after last night's dinner? Bon Sugar kicked the poison out. There are some that aren't, um, that aren't. Oh my goodness, Sir Doggo. He is angry. All right, give me a moment. I don't know why he's. Where did my phone go? All right, let me check my phone, see if someone decided to show up at my front door. Doesn't look like it. He's just mad. I'll be right back. <laughs> Sir, Happy Sir Doggo. Sir Doggo, you wish to repent. <laughs> repent for what? It was a reasonable question. Just one that I don't have the answer for. 
I'm sure, I'm sure they're fine. I'm sure Boncho takes care of everything. Great, it got back safe. It went all by itself to the glacial area. Children, whether human or animal, are full of curiosity. I'm glad to see the mom is now at ease also. Human, you have a really good sense of smell. Well, I didn't actually find it with my nose. Well, anyway, here is something for my gratitude. Sea grapes and some bay. And we completed the mission. So I think now, uh, let's go get some more like prehistoric fish fish to put on the menu. <laughs> Cause fish only have value if I can put them on the menu. Oh uh, wait, I need a mirror. And uh, <laughs> you know, so I'm gonna go find some more of those. Now that I went to the sea people village and my health is full again. <laughs> How convenient! Gelatinous snail fish. All right. Well, what's cool? I don't think the narwhal is back. We're about to find out. Narwhal is not back. Thank goodness. All right, we're going down to the bottom of the sea. All the way down. That's what the new suit allows me to do. Oh my God, what is that? I'm out of bullets. Uh, I'm just gonna not let it see me. I think I might actually have it before. I, I might have that one. Narwhal would be great on the menu. I have a couple of narwhal. Uh, we can definitely throw some narwhal on the menu. Welcome in, Disco Dinosaur. Hmm? Oh, I think the pile of rocks over there just moved. Should I check it with the camera? I don't know. Should you check it with the camera? Is the pile of moving rocks generally something that you, uh... Oh, it's a coelacanth. Hi, Animal Crossing. Oh, shit. Come back. Nice. Perfect. Yep. Wow, isn't that a coelacanth? What they call a living fossil? I can't believe it still exists in its ancient form like this. Udo will really like this. I've heard that they thought that these guys were extinct until someone, like, one of them showed up at a fish market. And then they were like, oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe they aren't as dead as we thought they were. Yeah, I'll stick with my poison tip. You look interesting. Please come back. And... There we go! It's a Pikaya. Pikaya? Pikaya. And fishermen have been using it on their boots for years? Like they use the skin or something? I hadn't heard that. Whoop. Hehe, <laughs> Mario Party mechanics, let's go. <laughs> Ooh, gun. Wait, have we already been in here? Maybe? I think we had to have been in here. Yeah, yeah, we've been in here. I've gotten these fish before. I'm pretty sure. Hold up. Let's kill one and make sure. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, back out to the, the fish that we need. You don't remember, but you learned it in school, so you didn't actually fact check it. Yeah! There are a lot of things they teach in school that don't actually turn out to be true. Like the whole your tongue tastes things differently depending on like where on your tongue you put it. So that was a lie. Ooh, what are you? You are Buckbean. Don't know what that means, but it sure sounds interesting. Also, you come here. 
Wait. You come here. Um, I cannot get close to that because it will kill me. That's not true. You're not dumb. It's what they taught everybody. Like, you're not dumb for believing what you were told in school, but there's really no evidence to support that different parts of your tongue are better at tasting things. Don't die underwater. I'm trying not to. I'll get this ocean quahog shell. I want more of the, 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 the thermal fish. That'd be really cool of them. Is there a dough bean? Deer beans? <laughs> have you ever had venison? I mean, it's not beans, but have you ever had venison? It's one of my favorites. Oh, it's still cotton away. Thank you, drone. There's some writing on the submarine panel. Sea blue forever. Guess they're really proud of what they do. They destroy the ocean. They should not be proud, but good luck working through that cognitive dissonance. Ooh, shovel. Maybe I can dig things up with this. I hope so. I mean, it's not Bambi. If anything, it's Bambi's mom, you know? There's a difference. Except it's also Buck. Um, Bucks, so. You look scary. Oh my god. That did nothing. Okay. I see. Okay. I need your belly. Ow. I missed the shot. That is not what I needed. Hi. Whoo. Whoo. Oh, man. I already used my drone. Uh, Dunkleos Dunkleosteus? Dun Dunkleos... Dunk... <laughs> What a name. Anyone here seen the Bambi versus Godzilla video? I have not. Why? Why would someone do that? You had venison when it was fresh from a hunter. I have had some like summer sausage, like venison sausage and stuff like that. Venison sticks. A lot of my friends like to hunt. <laughs> And considering the scourge upon my state that deer are, I am not too upset that hunters protect us at least a little when it comes to that. Ooh, venison steak. Yum. I'd like to try swordfish steak. That's something that one of my friends had one time. <sighs> Biggest fish, Dunkleosteus. Oh, hi, Udo. Right. Oh, you brought a picture of something. Can I see? A seelcanth? A living fossil that's barely changed from the Paleozoic era. But no one in the Paleozoic era actually saw it in person. So how can we be sure it's the same? Maybe this is what you call an inconvenient truth? This picture is going to make waves. I'll put your picture to good use. I'm sure the readers will love it. Nice. Thank you for the money. Let's go. Also, I like the giant cucumber that they are throwing up in the sky. That's not suggestive at all. What was I doing? What was I? What was I going to do? Ah, this is what I was going to do. Okay. 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 I haven't captured this fish yet. It's in the Divine Tree control room. Hmm. Wonder what I'll be fighting today. I was going to go to Eye Diver and figure out what I could do. Salvage drone, harpoon gun, air tank. Salvage drone. 
Wow, I can have it three times? Let's go! All right, um... So before I go, I'm gonna go to the farm. I'm gonna get my ingredients. Nope, not sea cucumber. Just normal cucumber. It's very odd. They were all about that, uh... Additional cucumber stuff. Oh my goodness, I can't see anything. It's dark. But I'm getting lots of rice. Oh, more weeds, I guess. Hold up. Harvest complete. There's a weed. Let's just go square by square. Make sure I got all the weeds. There we go. I did, I did, I did. Cool. I don't have money for anything. <laughs> Alright. Maybe I can buy some cucumber? Do you have any cucumbers? Nope. I already bought them. Okay. Well, they will get the cucumber that I give them. So, yeah. Mythical glowing wheat. Must be a sands fish because it's got dunk in the name. Why? Why? <laughs> Welcome in, Crooked Gamer. Dear Uprising. Yeah, they, um... Oh, did I really? Am I finally in, like, better definition because I'm using something that isn't as resource intensive and I can actually run on a higher... higher, uh, resolution? Cool. That means my shorts will improve in quality, too. Let's go! Had it just once, but it was good. I see. Hmm? Is something wrong? Cold. It's too cold. Uh, this place averages at 27 degrees Celsius even during the evening. My whole body is aching. I'll freeze to death. You, is there anywhere I can plant some seeds? Seeds? Yes, when I was climbing a snowy mountain of some faraway country, a local cooked me a meal with some peppers. It warmed me up. I could conserve my heart. I mean, my health. I was able to reach the top thanks to that dish. The local gave me some pepper seeds. Here. I'm still not sure. What am I supposed to make with this? One of my friends used to love this song that was inspired by hot pepper tuna. Huh, he's talking about Sammy's song. He said just listening to the song warms him up. Can you cook me some hot pepper tuna, please. I don't know what the ingredients are, but I'm sure that dish will warm me up. Hmm, let me see if I can plant these seeds first. <laughs> Make it quick, please. I'm freezing here. Dude, you're gonna be freezing for like the next two days. I don't know what you expect me to do. I can't make plants grow faster. This isn't Cult of the Lamb. Thank you very much. Hmm, cuisine made with pepper. First, I should take this pepper seed to Otto. And since Sammy wrote the song, Hot Pepper Tuna, he might know something about it. Then talk to those two first. Spicy pepper seeds. Speaking of, I nearly, I nearly died by freaking pepper seed today. It was so bad. Like, I, I, um, I accidentally inhaled it wasn't bad. It wasn't bad while I was actually chewing it, but I inhaled uh, like a pepper seed and it just burned all the way like back to my throat before I could cough it up again. It hurts so bad. All right. Inspection time. Did those seeds make it through customs? You can't just cultivate foreign plants without considering the ecosystem. I don't think the bl blue hole cares. I mean, as far as we're concerned, invasive species are everywhere in this place. <laughs> also, welcome in Abaddon. Damn right. Platinum acquired. New recipes added. New unlocks. More wasabi, another cooking slot, and added some interior stuff. Yay! We just need to get to 375 and 720 followers. We've got lots of cooking to do. 
Get rid of the red dots. I cannot, I cannot handle the red dots. The red dots must die. There we go. Red dots. Okay, we can actually, uh, we have another spot, don't we? I thought we did. Am I incorrect? Cooksta? Weren't you giving me another? I guess not. I thought I got another cooking spot, but maybe I was wrong. Well, I can't afford these guys, so... Oh, <laughs> uh, they will just have to wait. It's fine. We'll be fine tonight. Ooh. Okay, this will actually be really helpful. All right, the menu! Tonight's menu is going to include some wonderful variations on our cucumber dishes. Also, some vegetable sushi. Well, maybe not. I don't know yet. Uh, Thrasher Shark... Damn, I am going to have to catch so many more Thrasher Sharks. <laughs> oh. I don't want to waste rice. Not before I... Oh, sweet. Okay, what can I do that is more than one serving? Okay. We're going to do two of these, which is all I can make because it only uses two cucumbers and I get 10 servings of it. So that is a good move. Everything else is... Okay. This isn't a bad plot. This isn't a bad plan. All right, we'll do four of these. That's 18 servings. Okay. Um, For the people who I guess just want skewered cucumber, maybe? But that's three... That's three cucumbers in one dish. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Okay. We're going to do six of that. And seven of that. And that will be our cucumber dishes for the night. Uh, based off of price. Oh, wait. It's fine. I didn't actually look to see what other... Uh, People are just going to be paying out the ass for some cucumber, um, and they're going to like it. So that's how it's going to be. Skewered cucumber is your favorite high-end seafood dish. <laughs> it doesn't make much sense, does it? Okay, so we can put some... I didn't use any rice. Ooh, we're going to enhance. He offers it to the gods. <laughs> Welcome in, Shadow Moon. That's crazy to say. What's crazy to say? Oh, can I enhance again? I can, but let's actually just throw it on the menu for now. And then we'll throw some shark on the menu because we're extra AF. Which shark do I want? Ooh, four marlin meat. Let's just use up the marlin. And we can enhance the poor beagle. Wow. We can enhance the poor beagle a lot. All right, pay me for shark. All right, let's get rich! Paying out the ass for a cucumber? It's true! Look at how much we're charging for a freaking vegetable. All right, open Boncho Sushi. Ba -bum 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 -bum. Okay, good, good. Yay! People want the people want the cucumber dishes. Have you some nice tea so I can get a good tip. I'm gonna need you to get that tea that beer, cause I suck at pouring it. Get me that tip. 
Thank you. Oh shit, oh shit. I can make it, I can make it. Come on, I can make it, I can make it. She's gonna get pissed. Oh dear. There you go. All right, I'll pour beer. It's bad. It's good? It's perfect. Never had a perfect beer. Okay. Wasabi. Did you make a mistake coming here? What do you mean? Oh my god. There are so many people. Oh, that's bad. Uh. Shit. Damn it. <sighs> we might need... We just made $16,000. in fact a dinosaur i'm gonna go back in and see what uh recipes i can unlock and then i will i will show you raptor <laughs> oh it's vip visiting day oh dear hey what's up dave you seem a little down today sammy wanted to discuss something with you can you come to the chicken farm all right be there soon a penny for sammy's thoughts well good thing we had to be there anyway to the farm! Also, a Jason Voorhees and a luchador. Of course there is. Why wouldn't there be? Hi. Uh, please talk to me. Well, first, let's shop. Thank you. Cool things. Um, I think I need to talk to you. Otto, a customer gave me some pepper seeds. Can we plant it? This is... This is no ordinary pepper. You brought me habanero seeds. That's not that special. At least not in my experience. Yes, sirree. Fifth spiciest pepper in the world. Can't even harvest it without wearing gloves. Still, won't be difficult to grow here. Oh, then I should give it a try. Got a customer wrapped in thick clothes saying he feels cold even in this weather. All right, Sammy, do you know the recipe for hot pepper tuna? A customer mentioned your song and wanted to try the dish. I have a fan. I'm flattered. Hot pepper tuna. The song was inspired by a dish my mom would cook for me sometimes. My mom's pepper dish, especially her pepper tuna, it was the best. <laughs> I can still remember Sammy drenched in sweat, gobbling up every last bit. He would spend the entire day in the toilet. Then he would eat it again. Come on, Dad, you're embarrassing me. Anyhow, recipe. Don't know the exact recipe, but I know what ingredients you need. That should be enough for Boncho to come up with something. Tell me. Hmm, habanero. Should get my hands on some more of those seeds. <laughs> New recipe. Spicy pepper seeds. I guess I gotta plant them now. One, two, three, four, and a five. And some water. Expecting date in one days. <laughs> it's just me making my voice slightly deeper, but you like the voice that I gave. Ah. Can I? Oh, there we go. Um, sounds like you could tell him anything. <laughs> That's really cute. Welcome in, Ken. Hello, hello. All right. Well, I guess I can actually start, uh, I can start growing more stuff. I got the money for it. All right. Uh, let me see what ingredients the hot pepper tuna, hot pepper tuna needs. Hi, I'm told I need to talk to you. What is it, Sammy? Well, I'm preparing my new album. I haven't done any live shows, so I'm a bit short on cash. Oh, I see. I'd like to help you run your farm as a part-timer. What do you think? Part-time job? 
Yeah, I'll help you harvest crops, sow seeds, and weed, and fertilize your field. Hmm, that sounds pretty good. <laughs> I used to help my dad around his farm when I was a kid. I mean, that was a while ago, but I can still handle a part-time job. Right, so how do we do this? Talk to me whenever you need an extra hand. You can even decide how many days you want me to work at your farm. All right, we can help each other out. Hiring Sammy. From now on, I can hire Sammy to work on my farm. Sammy can harvest crops, sow seeds, and fertilize and weed fields. Let Sammy take care of your weed, seeds, and fertilizer. He'll make farming much easier. Select how much to you how to use fertilizer and the type of seed to plant. I don't even have fertilizer yet, right? Hmm. I mean, I have other things to spend my money on. I'm very sorry. I promise. I promise. I will. Uh, I'll hire you soon. But I need some more uh, rare fish so that I can make bank. Thank you, guys. Enjoy your lurk. Twyla putting hot pepper tuna on her soundboard. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to buy fertilizer right now. Um, Right, recipes. That's what I was going to do. I was going to look at the recipes so I knew what to plant. Sushi. And I can show off Raptor. Aren't we lucky? Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I really believe you hired me. Sushi is so good here, you'd think I'd eat all your profits. It is, in fact, a dinosaur. Okay, but for real, like, I don't have any other, like, spots. We need to get people who are better at... Actually, we're gonna train some people. What do we have for serving? Um, wasabi refill, but I like that she can drink serve. Um... Okay, we're training you. Do you do you serve drinks? Because you are an, you are a better server, and I need to figure out if you can. Can you can you pour drinks? That is the one thing. Oh, I learned a recipe from her. Awesome. Goodness, you are getting expensive to train. Training? Tip master. Mm, that's not good enough. That's not good enough. Okay, uh, who do I have waiting? I mean, we got Raul that looks pretty funny. I feel like he's a gimmick character and I should hire him so that I can train him and learn his recipes. So we're gonna do that just because. Oh, skill details. Wow. Oh, I'm dumb. Details. Well, that would have been better. Wait. Why aren't you telling me what you do? Do I have to look at them before they're hired? Hmm. Interesting. Okay, but those skills, those skills for Raul, um, I want them. Cooking is power. Power comes from the muscles. <laughs> that might come in handy later. All right. For now, I guess we train you. Because holy crap, our service was not good. All right. There you go. All right. And then. Uh, oh, you learn your other skill. No, you don't. Seems to have prepared something. Do you have a recipe for me? Boiled and deep fried white shrimp. Ooh. Welcome in, John. 
You finally got Dave the Diver during the winter sale. It is a lot of fun. I'm having, I'm having a lot of fun with it. Although I think I'm almost to the end. All right, that should hopefully carry us through the night. A little better. Fingers crossed, wait. Yes, give me more money. Give me more money so I can train more people and do more things. What's up with staff? Doesn't matter. Okay, what do we want to research? Whew. We are running low on flames. Okay, I know I have a lot of, Jesus Christ. Um, Stellate puffer. I do have a lot of white shrimp. A lot of white shrimp. Yeah, money, 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 money. It will be mine. The money will be mine. Menu. Uh, not yet, not yet, not yet. Phone. Cooksta. <laughs> Love the pajamas. Cool. Thank you. Yes, excellent. Please. Keep, uh, keep singing my praises. Delightful. <laughs> And then farm now. We already went. Wait, shit. Hapepetuna. Um, menu. Where's the hot pepetuna? Hot pepetuna. Do I have to research the hot pepper tuna? I bet I do. God, I have so many foods. Okay, it's not going to be here. All right. Okay. Tuna sushi. Hot pepper tuna. Um, blue tuna chutoro. Okay, so I need to catch a tuna. A hot pepper tuna. And then harvest some habanero. All right, so I just need to catch tuna. Bluefin tuna, though. So that's going to be fun. All the cool pixel art for the cooks to post. Yeah, this game is lovely. They do such a good job. All right. Whoops. Shh, shh. I don't care. I don't care. Let me shop. You don't have what I need today, because of course you don't. All right, eye diver. What do we have? We can increase the dive knife. We can increase the harpoon gun. Yep, it's a max level, woo! All right, well, let's go catch some tuna. And it's VIP D-Day, but we already have what I needed. So, yay. <laughs> American Lobster. Ooh, Lobster. Defeated Wolf Dream Researcher. Getting close to you means death. It doesn't mean death. Just some mild trauma. <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> hello, hello. I'm not going to kill you. That'd be horrific. But I do need subjects to research on. So, I mean, take that as you will. <laughs> Thank you for the sub. Right now, we're uh, causing some nightmares for fish, though. Uh, so that's, that's where we're at. Trying to find some tuna. And I don't see any... Because of course there aren't. Why would they give me the fish I need for the mission right away? Mm. All right. Well, this is gonna be a lengthy dive down. Let's go, let's go. I've got enough air. I can just zip, zip, zip. <laughs> Thank you. 
I've got stupid cuttlefish. I've got more audio on the horizon. I just, I don't want it to, I want it, I want to do it right, you know? <laughs> so I've been taking a little bit more time on it. Hello, shark. Ingredients. These are always necessary. This barracuda, really? Would not suggest. Hammerhead. So about that. Whoops. Damn. Wow, he's fast. Uh, please come back. I need to finish killing you. Thank you. Boop, boop. <laughs> Fuck off do it right your voice is already perfect but the writing has to be perfect it has to be that perfect um that perfect meditation to really make you feel it you know it's not about the voice it's about the 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 writing leading you down into a deep um experimental state hi frill Thank you. I will gladly take you uh, in my pouch. Twy rider. I mean, I try. I twy. <laughs> that was bad. That was bad and I feel bad. UV? No, oxygen. That is not what I need. It's getting darker. Bad things will happen. I can take on anything in here. Have you, have you seen any Dave the Diver before? We're just about at the end. And if you do plan on playing it, I don't want you to spoil yourself. One more invasive species removed from the environment, which everything is invasive here. Nothing is supposed to be here. That's the point of the game. All right, we got our flashlight. We can now move forward. Ow. Even you're an invasive species. I mean, given what you have told me about yourself, I do believe that's true. Okay. Maybe I can find a, a quick way around. Good luck, have fun. Talk to you later, but you understand writing can be hard. Thank you. Have a good night. Have fun. This thing wants to kill me. I'm not going to let it. Oh, maybe I can get a better knife. Can I get? Yes, a pickaxe. Please give me all of the materials so that I can craft more weapons to kill more things with. I'm a terrible person. Everything must die. <laughs> oh, no. Huh? Oh, that's a sign. I was like, what is the thing on top of the box? Just a sign. I need the pickaxe or I would take the snake whip. There we go, cookie cutter shark. I think those are worth quite a bit. Seahorse. Thank you. <gasps> Seahorse racing. I'll skip the underwater scooter. I will take this opal though. This is rock goals, by the way. I don't have an opal yet, um, but I'm, I'm something of a collector of rocks myself. And that is one that I have yet to get. One of my my nicest finds recently was Laramar. It's a super pretty um, blue and like marbled with white, almost like 
I don't want to say like steak marbling because that's not exactly true, but it's very pretty. And I was very happy to have found a, a rough version. It wasn't tumbled. I prefer the look of tumbled, but it's mine. <laughs> Rock appreciator gang. Hell yeah. I'll shake to that. Your birthstone. I don't know what month that is. Um, my birthstone is sapphire. It's totally not a reason why I chose to play Pokemon Sapphire when it came out. Totally not. I can't be this tired already. Why is that? Wh I slept and napped. What the hell is this? This is winter. I need to get... I, um, I've started taking my vitamins again. I think I need to get some vitamin D built back up in my body. Emerald. Emerald should be May? Yours is. You'll remember it eventually in the sapphire colored hair. Yeah, it's funny how that works, right? I knew someone who had a emerald as a birthstone. That, that wasn't just pulled out of my ass. It was, I, I distinctly remember them getting jewelry with emerald in it. Yes, enter the Sea People Village since we have now taken such considerable detours. Yes, I want to ride the beluga. Get me to a mirror, please. Garnet? Not sure which one that is. I only know mine and other people's that, that I have seen. I think my mom's was Topaz? Not sure. <laughs> Gonna make a VTuber theory on Twilight and Sapphire. Oh dear. Oh dear. <laughs> What have I started <laughs> with my obsession with rocks? I know you're here, Narwhal. I know you're here somewhere, Narwhal. Right? I know you come back. Where are you? There you are. Hello. Terribly sorry. They didn't give me any nuts this time. So you just get to die. I'm very sorry. It's because Twilight rocks. They're called minerals. Well. Well then. I did have to take geology in college. That was actually a really fun class. We got to go out and explore our local geology, which is more interesting than the flat Midwest would suggest, but I enjoyed it. Ooh, what is this? Topaz, well, speak of the devil. What? Oh, a dolphin in a place like this? Must be a Lysodolphus Peroni. Heard they're pack animals, but that one is swimming alone. Geology mentioned, yeah, I had a lot of fun with it. By far one of the most like involved classes, even if I had to skip some of the classes for astrology, uh, not astrology, <laughs> astronomy. Disappeared behind the iceberg. Are we not taking a picture of the dolphin whose name I can't remember? Oh, I see. There are more of them behind the iceberg. School of dolphins is always a sight to see. Maybe I should take a picture of them. Aw, oh, man. Now I got to wait for him to come back around. Maybe. Ah, no, no, I need all four or I need all five. All right. All right. Nope. Shh. 
All right, how do we do this? Where do they converge? Ah! Oh, they're gone before I could take a picture. Maybe next time. I didn't realize that was a timed event. Haven't had one of those before. Sticky bomb gun. That was quite useful. I'll grab that one. You would uninstall to take a competent astronomy class. It was incredible. Like, I ended up taking... So that I could finish on time, I ended up taking the astronomy lecture back at my community college and then please don't you are coming at me very quickly and that scares me thank you um I ended up taking the lecture back at my uh, my community college, but I took the lab at my university. And our professor was incredible, like actually passionate about astronomy to the point that he had a meteorite belt buckle, like the, the actual, like it's not the buckle itself, but it's like the cover that you see some people put on their buckles. Whoa, 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 whoa. Ow. Everything down here wants to kill me. <sighs> Xenacanthus. I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. Not you, not you, not you, not you. I'll catch this. And I can do nothing with that. Uh, is there air down here? I could really use some air. Too many things that want to kill me. Professor told history like it was a bedtime story. I had a good high school history teacher my college history teacher left a lot to be desired but you can't win them all right <laughs> there we go 2024 be the year of the lurker <laughs> guess you'll wait and see i mean it might as well be you are always appreciated no matter what I missed, I missed, I missed, I missed. Ah! Okay, one hit of this should be enough. Wait. Oh, I was like, I'm just straight up catching it? What is happening here? There we go. That will be able to make some interesting dishes with that. Pay me more money. <laughs> but yeah, he took us out on, um, he took us out on like field trips and like out to woods where we could actually see things. Whoa, please don't. Taught us how to identify various stars, which I still remember some of, not all of, but some. Oh, shit. So many big fish. All right. Might be time to call it a trip. Just about. And he actually taught us, like, how the planets moved, how the sun moved, how the Earth moved. I have a lot of good memories about that class. And then there was one where it was kind of like, if you understood 
um basically circumpolar and uh circumpolar stars and axial tilt and things like that they were all quote unquote trick questions where if you knew you knew and that class like that lab it was like a three hour lab my lab partner and i got out because we realized what was happening we got done in probably 20 or 25 minutes because all we had to do was be like oh like what percentage of the day are these uh is the sun visible well it would be 100 percent of the day or it would be zero percent of the day and what percent of the day are these stars visible and it would be either be like 100 percent of the day or it would be zero percent of the day it was if you knew you knew and you just got out of class really fast it was delightful it helps that i had a lab partner who cared that always helps Ooh, what else did we get oh yeah the xeno canthus xenocanthus <laughs> i haven't captured it yet but i'm gonna all right but I forgot to check on my fish today. And I forgot to check on my crops today. We gotta go do that. All right. Okay, we've planted grass. Pluck that weed just because. Um. Well, there aren't any weeds to pull. Okay. Can't complain about that. I would be completing more of the story, but the problem is the drone hasn't finished cutting things yet. So we may have to spend another day on this. Unable to obtain roe or breed fish. Well, I guess we just have to clear that shit out, don't we? Ooh, thresher sharks, let's go. Sell two of those. Sell two of the starry puffers um don't really care about you but the density is down so that's fine Ooh, sell the long nose saw shark keep everything else surprised i haven't managed to get other things at depth unless do i have to buy them what is going on here have to buy them <laughs> shit i thought i just had to catch fish for them all right well we'll have to pay for that next <laughs> whoops history professor had funny obviously wrong answers to questions that were made up just for laughs it was great that's a good professor just one who rolls with it and doesn't get tilted about it wait i don't want to dive i don't want to dive i want to mirror it's fine i mean i've been making bank regardless couldn't ask for more i moved a little in the heart rate monitor was like oh, it's my time to shine <laughs> hi narwhal how quickly we meet ow how quickly you kick my ass Please don't clip into the wall. I need you. There's so I I've never seen the drone come my direction. I was like, what is getting bigger on my screen? Ah. All right. I'm missing some fish in this area. So I do want to try to catch some. I'd prefer if you didn't run away so quickly, please. Nope, got you. Maybe it's closer down to the thermal vents. Or maybe it's you. You look pretty. Have I caught one of you yet? Hmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. No, 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 no. Come back. Come back. You in particular. You are the one that I have been brutalizing. I need you. Ah. Point one inch heart rate monitor. <laughs> Let me just spike this heart rate. Well, it is kind of how it's supposed to work. Hmm. Just, I like the triple axle too much, you know? Or I guess it's the quattro axle. But I might come back and collect that so that when I leave, I can have it as, like, in my inventory so I can craft it later if I want. <laughs> Be gone. <laughs> that was just mean. They'll find their way. I saw a shark over here. What a wake-up call. Damn. Whoa, I'm out of bullets. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh, dear. Okay, I need bullets. Before I do anything else, I need... Hey! Bullets! Also you. Get over here. I want to see what you are. I want to see very badly what you are. You are Alanipterus. I feel like I got one of you. I just didn't recognize you. It's a bit cute now how chat has text boxes. Are the text boxes big enough? Are they visible on like, they might be a little small on mobile. I'm not sure. But I might need to, I might need to adjust the width of the boxes so that the, the text is more obvious. I am kind of happy though that I'm in would you please get away from the poison rock? Would you please not kill me while I try to kill you? There we go. Wait, it eventually stops? Hmm. But yeah, I kind of like the boxes too. Happy little, little accidents, I guess, from having to change software. And I'm in high def now. E. <laughs> Can't do better than that. All right, I kind of want this to be an upgrade instead of a different weapon. It is a different weapon. Oh no. I know there are big ass things around here that I don't want to fuck with. Out of the blue. I believe in you, little drone. I know you can do this. How you have not been taken out by one of these big ass creatures, I don't know, but good on you for continuing to live. Oh, there it is. Nope, I'm not, I need. Shit, that just completely nullified it. need you to go past me come on no not that direction not that direction i need to be i need to be on the underside of your belly there you go thank you cool easy yeah it's a brave little drone look at it go i whoops i didn't get all the meat i don't actually want to fly into it because i don't know if it will kill me i'm just gonna let it uh I'm just gonna let it exist and not fly in the way of its laser you know seems like a good idea what is this i remember we got the frozen cod last time but that doesn't mean that it doesn't make it any weirder i'm gonna stick with what i have 
the frozen cod is too much of a toss-up. I have a guaranteed like 19 to 70 something. I can't do math right now. Uh, 19 to 70 something gun. I'm not going to risk that for a 30% chance at a cod or a frozen thing. Although it is just a normal weapon. But I also have 10 damage on my knife too. Oh, yay, new fish. New fish, new fish. Fish is under tip. <sighs> really? <laughs> Usually just fight math. I mean, I'm good at math, but there are some things that I just can't multitask with and math and gaming is one of them. Oh, come on. Please? Please? Thank you. Oh, it's a Pikaya again. This one wants to kill me, so I feel no remorse at killing it first. Maybe. There we go. I know there are... Yeah, these guys. I don't like that you can change direction when you charge. That makes me very uncomfortable. I recognize that I have cultivated the puns in my chat, but come on. <laughs> self defense You get a Pedumptus. Congratulations. That was actually like good not actually good like that's not what i mean like <laughs> in terms of puns <laughs> i laughed more than i groaned <laughs> let me just keep digging this hole see how far i can get it was pun good yeah yeah the undertale puns making twilight deep inhale so i've heard that right now um undertale yellow is almost in like copyright limbo because the, the it uses remixes of like the popular themes because obviously it's a fan game why not but apparently people are getting copyright struck despite the fact that you're not supposed to get copyright struck for using undertale music but then they even changed the terms of service to include that you can't use the music in fan games. And so now people are getting struck because the fan game used it. And it's just a whole shit show and very, very uncool, very unpog. Because I know like a few streamers wanted to do it, but then mysteriously did not get perms. And it's just kind of like, now it makes sense. It's just, sucks that there are corporations that are like yes i would rather not have this free advertising for music that has been remixed and is not even the official soundtrack which we know that people are still going to listen to gotta love it oh i can just one shot these he <laughs> come to me itty bitty babies just gonna thin this herd <laughs> oh, I missed. Still has the remixes and cover part in their rules despite the rule change. Uh, I don't know. It's just frustrating. It's very frustrating, I think, to put seven years of your life into something and then for it to just kind of get snatched away. Not that it's snatched away, people will still play it. But knowing that now it's causing trouble for streamers, like I bet, I hope they don't feel bad. It's really not their fault. I hope these things are worth something. <laughs> I hope these are good money because I have a lot of them. There are three. 
three left. Oh no. I'm not beating the allegations that I'm just a murderer here. Things are going well. Um, I want to progress the story, but I can't until I uh, wait two in-game days. But the problem is I still don't want to waste the fishing time. So I'm still coming down here and killing things. Um, so it's just going to take a little longer on the, uh, the beating the game part. We might go into another day for this, which I had hoped to beat it. But even if I can beat it by next week, I think I'll be, I'll be satisfied. We already beat uh, Call to the Lamb this week, so I can start a new game. I don't know which one it will be, uh, but I'll figure it out. I have plenty to choose from. Hopefully something a little shorter. I kind of want to do something on the shorter side so that I can play more other games. <laughs> I know Hollow Knight, I'm a considerable amount of the way through, so that'll be good. I hear my voice creaking. Uh, I'm going to get some water after I get done with these fish. Oh, you're the polar eel pout. Twilight is canon canonically an extinction level event. I am not. I am a lone... I am a lone fisher man in this game. Just catching enough food to stock my restaurant. I'm not a massive fishing boat. I'm not a corporation coming in with their nets and murder chemicals. It's fine. I'm fine. <laughs> A sticky bomb gun. Yeah, I'll catch it this... I'll collect it this time. I'll collect it since we're almost to the end where I'll need to, uh... To have things. An Avengers level threat. I am not! That was John Watson. The asshole who came at me with, like, a military level submarine. And still lost. But I also think he's dead, so it's not like he can live to tell the tale of how thoroughly he was humiliated and beaten by a single diver. Mm -hmm. I can forge it now. Let's go. Ooh, look at all the stuff we got. Lost to a magically a Pluridon. I mean, in his de in his defense. Wait, you're right. It was the magically a Pluridon. It wasn't me. I was a distraction, and that's all that mattered. Marinka, let's clear these red dots. I'm missing the lobster. Gosh darn. Um, and then third glacial cave, and the glacial area. Okay. Well. Oh, so many fish that we have yet to catch. Oh, well. To the restaurant! Wait! Eco-watcher. Uh, I got 25. Bring up a narwhal to the surface. <laughs> oh, I just had to drone it! I see! Yep. There we go. And then... Bring... A Dunkleosteus up to the surface. I need to maintain my, uh, my drone until then. Dangerous gemstones. Aquamarine glacial area. Okay. All right. Cool. <laughs> to the restaurant! West Coast Avengers level threat could be the compromise here. Osteoporosis. <laughs> oh no. I actually prone to that. Given my genetics, it sucks. I don't want osteoporosis. I'll drink all the milk and eat all the yogurt. Oh. Oh dear. 
Hello, everyone! This is Yui from NDC Station! Ladies and gentlemen, as you know, today is the top- is the day of the final clash and challenge the chef! Vancho, are you ready? Yes. How about you, Alex? Oh my god, I forgot that he's like this. My fingers are uncontrollably wiggling. Excellent! Then let's begin challenge the chef now! Right. Cooking mini game. I forgot. All right. Gotta put him on a serious face. Gotta do this cooking mini game. Dude, you're from Britain. What the fuck? All right. Cut the kelp. How do I cut the kelp? Okay. All right. That was easy enough. Roast the onion. I feel like I should be doing this in VR. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah, basically. I did some sauteing of some onions myself yesterday. <laughs> I'm something of a chef myself. Okay, I bet we're gonna be rotating. Maybe? Oh. Rhythm game. Little do they know I have been playing theater rhythm recently. Hehehe. <laughs> Turn off the heat. All right. It was on sale. I couldn't resist. <laughs> I found it for super cheap. There was no resisting it. like my one holiday splurge on myself. <laughs> All right. Perfect. Now I think I have to pour the sauce, right? Nope, it's just done. He really made fish and chips. The deep fried competition and he just stuck with the fish and chips. <laughs> of course I won. I'm the best. Nice! Score of 99! What? Alex's fish and chips lost? What an upset. My fries are the best in the world. Yes, your fish and chips indeed tasted excellent. Incredible, actually. What is the theme of this contest? The theme? It's fried dishes. Not quite right. The theme for this contest was fry the sea. Masterfully, masterfully fried cod is good on its own, but that alone does not represent the sea. However, Boncho's dish was. What kind of soy sauce did you use? I added chopped green lava and added it to normal soy sauce. As I expected. I liked your stark and squid combination, but the highlight was your soy sauce recipe. The soy sauce enriched with the flavor of the sea better represented the taste of the sea. What an impressive flavor! Your dish gave me a feeling of exploring the sea from the coastal waters to the deep sea. That was a fabulous adventure. The texture of your fried dish was quite good as well, but the game changer was your soy sauce. Alas, my perfect fries were not enough to satisfy the judge. It was a close match. Let us hear what Boncho has to say. She's going to cut him off again, isn't she? You need to be careful when making the soy sauce. That's... 
Thank you, Poncho. The champion prefers actions over words, and we love it. And it's time to wrap up today's episode of Challenge the Chef. Today, Boncho won the contest. This is... Wait a moment. I am pleased by today's contest, and I would like to give him a piece of advice. You, I see your menu is expanding, but the drinks you offer stay the same, yes? Do not make me pour more drinks. I suck at them. No. Because I am a chef, not a barkeep. You said the same thing before. Dining is a comprehensive experience. What do you pair up with your pasta? A glass of wine, a glass of cola, or just a glass of water? It will significantly change the dining experience. Your place cannot satisfy the various tastes of customers with a limited selection of drinks. This is my gift to you. It's a cocktail dispenser. No! No! Sounds like a fighting game announcer. <laughs> Big Iron Chef vibes. I feel like that's the point. Oh, please. Not every cocktail is sweet. You can make interesting cocktails using sake as a base. Sake is kind of sweet, though. Well, of course, you're not in charge of drinks. That hungry-looking guy. Hey, yes, you. Me. I'll leave this cocktail dispenser here. You find out how to use it best. Oh, a gift from Vincent! A cocktail dispenser! Fancho Sushi will offer more items soon! And we can't wait to see what will be added to its menu! See you next time! This was reporter Yui! Fry the sea, don't you mean the deep water horizon oil spill? Fuck, that's dark! Science Comrade is a fighting game announcer. I wish. Maybe someday. Cocktails? This dispenser is designed to serve three cocktails at the same time. Well, I am not familiar with cocktails, but come to think of it, this is like a drink version of omakase. Yeah, that makes sense. It's our job to serve the drink customers want. Why don't we make more money by adding cocktails to the menu? No, do not make more money by adding cocktails to the menu. We're going to make them hate us. I don't want to make cocktails. No. No. The hungry looking guy game announcer for discord smash tournament i don't do well off the cuff on like announcer shit though i don't want to don't make me do this no hmm I don't care that it's 80 bucks. Don't make me do this. Please. Mm. Mm. <sighs> All right. Rob any number of banks in Minecraft to fulfill announcer comrade. I'm working on, excuse me, God. Uh, I'm working on it. I'm trying. Okay, well, I need to put some awesome stuff on the menu. So, Thresher Shark. Pufferfish. Let's make people pay even more for that. And then we'll add it to the menu. Oh, yes. This one's just so good. Pouring Slurpees through 7-Eleven. Just throw it all together. I know there are people who do that. All right. I don't want to overload on shark. It's just that we just keep getting like a whole bunch of shark. Yes, nothing under $200 now. Have fun paying. Tiger shark. Where's all those little... Ooh, narwhal. Yeah, we'll enhance the narwhal. Let's make some money off of this guy. Once more, with feeling. Okay. Where were all those little guys I was catching? Ooh. Interesting. 
Well, we can bump these for sure. And then we'll add some shrimp to the menu. It's basically shrimp. I'm sure people can't tell the difference. Now, the question is... Ooh. Sure. Yeah. We'll add one of those. He <laughs> money. What does ranking up get me? Well, uh, hope that the training that I put in, well, let's do a little more training, actually. Um, hey, Raptor, become even better at serving, please, because we need your help. Kyoko 2. Thank you. All right. Oh, cross your fingers. This is about to get messy. Oh, look at her go. Very cool. Raptor. Raptor, thank you. Okay, good. All right. Keep an eye out for drinks, I suppose. Drinks. Ooh. Ah, it was good. Okay, let's try this. Okay. No. Oh, there we go. Wait, wait, that was wrong. Shit. Ah, I'm sorry. It's a new mechanic. It's fine. Wasabi. There we go. Okay. Well, I fucked that up. Oh, she already got the beer. Holy fuck. Okay. There we go. Oh no! Go run! Run! Run faster! Run faster! I genuinely don't understand. Okay, let's try this again. Okay. And then... Uh... Oh, do I have to do it all at once? Oh shit. No, no, no. Ah! Fuck! I couldn't, I couldn't get out of, I couldn't get out of doing the table. Holy shit. I'll still take 12,000. That's fine. 12,000's fine. I hate it. I hate it so much. Oh God. Dr. Bacon. Ooh, I barely managed to cut it. It's very thick and tough. It's large enough for a person to go through. Come down here when you're ready. Finally, I'm in the control room. It's common sense to clear all the missions before fighting the boss in an RPG. This is not an RPG game, but being overly prepared doesn't hurt. <laughs> Get your shit done! Huh? Some kind of mail is here. Should I check it? A shrimp party? Say no more! Are you sure this isn't an RPG, Dave? I mean, we've got that guy that we're supposed to cook for, but like in terms of missions, we don't have any missions. So I think I'm good? Whoops. Sorry, didn't mean to unlike super secret boss. <laughs> He's been hanging around Duff too much. Ooh, I have so many weeds. All right, we got to go take care of those weeds. Yes. And off we go. I got an egg. Don't you dare kill my 
crops. Oh. The habaneros are already done. I'm okay with that. What do I want to buy from you? I don't have any onion. Um, and I don't have any cherry tomato. Or beans. Or cucumber. The cucumber was pretty good for... Price. Maybe I'll grow some cucumber. I'll buy six cucumbers, three onions, and three eggplants. And I don't have to water since it's raining today. Get out of my way. Off my crops. Honestly, what are you doing? Put you in the dish? I don't, I don't think people want to, no offense, no offense, of course. I don't think people want to eat bag. I could be wrong, but I, I don't think they do. All right, got more shrimp. That's good, considering we need them. Yay. Cool. All right. All right, you. Please unlock places for me. Yes. And yes. And yes. <laughs> there we go. Fuck it. Give me the last one, too. Yeah. Cool. Thanks. Cannot believe all these fish I've been catching are going to waste. All right, to the boat. We have places to go. Bags are a natural delicacy in the fish world. No! Even Zula won't eat you. Bags are high in fiber. Oh, God. Yep, get them those uh, plastic bags along with the plastic rings and all the all the delicious, delicious, colorful plastic. Mm. I need that. All right, down we go. Well, where there is a narwhal. Do I get the narwhal? I do need more meat. Oh, shit. Oh, oh no. <laughs> what are we smashing or passing? Hi, Dodge. Dodge is... Dodge Segan? Dodge Segan? Welcome in. The ground is rumbling again. It's getting more intense. I should quickly go down to the control room. We're about to get murdered. Fucking cutscene. What the fuck? For that, you die. I was debating leaving you alive. Now you die. Getting me when my back was turned. You are a narwhal of no honor. Get your ass back here. Please, not that close. Not that close. Oh, shit. Ah! Oh, fuck! Okay, I'm retreating. We've already had uh, deep, deep blue on our asses. It's fine. It's fine. Oh shit, that, that is a shark. That is a shark and I'm about to die! Oh no! Oh, oh thank goodness. It'd be different if they were actual fish, but they're not, so I feel no remorse. Charger cords are the fish world equivalent of... 
Reeve. Where did the narwhal go? Where did the narwhal go? Hello. Hello again. You are very fast. Yay. Got the narwhal. So many dangerous fish around here. Yeah. I mean, I guess that's what happened when you've been isolated from people. Everything is a threat, right? What's in the box? We have another sticky bomb gun. Sure. I'll try it up. Got some soy sauce. Okay. Oh dear. I won't hurt you if you don't hurt me. I'm just on my way down. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. Please do not have the Dunkleosaurus. I just need to get over to the drone. Whew! Thank goodness. Made from made from scratch? What does that mean? Now you'll be able to go in. I feel hot air coming out from inside. Well, that's not a good sign. Be careful. <laughs> so dismissive. New region. Surprise the soy sauce bottle survived the sea pressure. I mean, it's glass. Maybe. Beards are severely mutated. Doors blocked by tree sap. There should be a way to go inside. There's always a way to go inside. Have you figured out nothing, Dave? It's a sail. It's a snail I can pick up. That's funny. I don't think I should... Should I put the snail on the tree sap? <laughs> I like the music that is now getting very... Okay, so there's... Oh! This seems like a bad idea. But I guess we don't have a choice. All right. All right, I passed it. Bye bye, snail. You're not very smart, are you, Dave? No, the path is cut off. Other paths are blocked by the tree sap as well. A sea scorpion and mutated divine tree fruit. This is terrible. I must somehow find a way. All right. Cool. For every door, there is a key from Dark Siders. Oh, hey. You didn't tell me you were going to come after me. Oh, that's a shell. Okay. Oh, they're everywhere. Can I kill you? Please? Oh, I can. I guess they just assume it's very obvious that they will come kill you. Oh shit. Oh, I got one. Ah! I don't want to go in there. Fuck. Shit. You're more easily turn aroundable than the other ones. And I don't like that at all. 
Welcome in, Inochi. If you're just gonna insult the game, get out of my chat, Dodge. Like, if you're not gonna actually participate in the chat responsibly, just leave. Don't, please don't, please don't. Okay, weak enough. Yay! All right, there was one more, I think. I'm gonna get air. I need air! Well, uh, can you blame me for wanting bombs? Okay, never mind. Shit! I missed! No! <sighs> Megalograptus. Interesting. Am I melting the sap, I'm gonna assume? Yeah. Oh shit, one lived. Oh, I can pop the sap using this mutated divine tree fruit. Yeah, don't say. Onto the door you saw earlier. Well, the problem is we can't get back because you kind of like put a snail on there, which wasn't the best idea. Oh no, please stop, please stop, please stop. <sighs> okay, so I'm gonna guess that I need to carry one of these then. Maybe not that one. Maybe the one sticking out further? There we go. Oh yeah, you're right. It does explode. Hydrothermal vent is blocking the door. Okay, so I'm gonna have to, I guess, move very quickly with the snail. Also, I'm so sorry, snail. I'm sorry for frying you. Better pass it before it moves again. That is a massive crater. Top wall looks loose. May collapse if the crater erupts a little higher. I wonder what we get. Oh, thank you, snail. Also, I'm sorry, snail. That sucks. But I will take the opportunity to use your brethren and uh, get this water or this air. Nope. No, you don't. No, you don't. As a vent plug. Apparently it doesn't work. It doesn't, it doesn't care. Huh. All right, your messages are hidden now. I'm done with you. Please leave, nobody is gonna interact with you anymore. All right. All right. Wait, do I have to, do I have to put the snails all on the, maybe that's what I have to do. I have to plug it all with the snails. Yeah, that's what I have to do.
Oh, jeez. Oh! Shit. Okay. What if, snail, you just, like, kind of land off of that? That's all right. Yep, yep. Yay! I mean, if we didn't get out of the way, we're fucking dead now, but, uh... My up is open now. We should not have lived through that. Should bring the divine tree fruit here with me. Yes, we should. Okay. All right. Up next to the sap. Up next to the sap before it blows up. Yay! The door is open. Looks spooky inside. <laughs> I should be careful. Well, we have found our way in. Go down deeper. Yeah, that was a fun one. I like the snail. Yeah, I'll get this oxygen. I would also like a refill of bullets, if possible. Okay, timing based, timing based, easy enough. Okay. Deeper we go. We're at 600 meters. Oh, shit. Rude. All right. This is kind of fun. A little annoying once you figure the mechanic out and then you just have to wait for the, the, the timing to end, but fun. Okay. Whoops, sorry. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna bring this guy over even closer because that way. Ow. Jeez. Would you just go in the vents, please? There we go. All right. Whew, I hope there's oxygen. This level is hot. Okay. What are those gross looking eggs? Why are they attached to the divine tree roots? Where there's eggs, there's mommy. Mm. Strange creatures have hatched from the eggs. And before I get into a boss fight, I'm gonna take a very short break and I will be right back.
All right. Well, apparently some strange creatures have hatched from the eggs. Whoops. <laughs> Wait, those creatures. I've seen them in one of the Sea People's murals. All right. Tenjin once told me that an ancient engineer altered creatures by infusing the divine tree energy. These may be the creatures. They survived for such a long period of time, still breeding. Oh, I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Thank you, Brian. What's happening is I'm getting some air and some gun. <laughs> That's what's happening. Oh, at least they go down easy. Whoops, shot the same one twice. Actually, now that I know that they're... Oh, I got two in one! Let's go! More hatchlings? Oh, I defeated the hatchlings. Now there is... Snail. No more hatchlings? Really? That was all? Okay, cool. Thank you for your service, Snail. Now I am trapped forever. <laughs> Remember to mute on a new software. That is because I don't mute using the software. I use my GoXLR, so it's still have it. <laughs> it's just a bu button that I can actually manually push. I like it. <laughs> there are even more eggs here. They look like they're ready to hatch, but I can't go back now. There is a door there. If I could melt the mucus covering the door. There's an intact divine tree fruit. Should I put it in that divine tree fruit device? Probably. I think we're, we're established enough. I don't need you to hold my hand all the time. Although I don't know where the device is. I'll have to find that. <laughs> Where's the device? Oh, here it is. All the way at the very bottom. Ha, huh, 666 meters. I feel like they're trying to tell me something. Good, the contraption is working. Maybe I can melt the mucus by projecting the light from the divine tree fruit. Oh no, the eggs are hatching. I need to get rid of them before I can melt the mucus. Do you? Do you? <laughs> Sneezes, heart rate goes crazy. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. Wow, they took a lot of my oxygen. Oh, that was the last of them. <laughs> Let me melt the mucus covering the door. Isn't that what... Oh, we have to position it. That's all right. That's what's going on. I like my laser cutter. That's pretty damn cool. Oh, no, there's more. More eggs are hatching. I need to get rid of them before doing anything else. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. You had to escape, didn't you? <laughs> They're growing in number. Must open the door and escape. Whew. There we go. Killed him. Killed him with the laser beam. I started blasting. God, more hatching. This time I'll eliminate them once and for all. There's 
so many. Okay, they'll they'll at least kill themselves. Whew. Maybe I should have just set up a barrier. That should be the last of them. Let's quickly melt the mucus covering the door before anything else shows up. Hasn't it already been melted? What if something comes through the door? Nice, the mucus is all gone. Must be the core of the control room over there. Let's find out what it is. Go through the open door. I sure would like some oxygen right about now. You sense a dangerous creature's presence. Enter, I don't have a choice. Sure would like some oxygen. Ugh, the offspring of that ancient creature is clinging to something. Is that the nucleus of the divine tree? Could that be why the divine tree is acting strange? I'll need to get rid of these creatures first. Yeah, that's great and all. Um, please tell me there's some oxygen over here. Please? There is no oxygen. Um, so we're probably gonna have to start this over. Like, at least from here. Aw, oh, man. <sighs> See, Ganon? Like divine tree's nucleus has stabilized again. Nucleus has stabilized again. Guess this should do it. I hope the earthquakes will stop now. I should start heading back to land. Did you not see that there are still many an egg left? Many, many an egg left. Ah, <sighs> what on earth is that? Is that the mom of those creatures I saw earlier? No wonder there were eggs everywhere. So I'm fucked. Oh, it's our little drone. Hi, Red Ranger. Uh, well, we just found a scary monster. I tracked you down in case you needed help. What's going on here? That huge monster came out from the lava. Hmm, I know what that is. I've seen it a lot in the texts about the ancient civilization of the sea people. Looks like the character known as Yahweh. An ancient beast from legend, still alive. And it's massively bigger. The sea people elder told me about some old experiment. We must have absorbed the divine tree and the geothermal energy to get this big. We have to defeat it and stabilize the divine tree. Dave, I'm counting on you. What? How can I possibly defeat such a huge ancient creature? You took down a dinosaur just a moment ago. No, that was a different situation. I don't even have any weapons or bullets now. Duff! Dave, isn't the weapon right here? Huh? Duff, what are you talking about? I told you, this drone has all kinds of hidden features. I knew this day would come, but it was a bit sooner than expected. I'll input the activation code for the drone's attack mode. I found the Pacific Rim, the sea kaiju, and the bar sim. This game doesn't know what it wants to be. Wow, it can do that? This drone can maintain oxygen levels, fire unlimited bullets, and even manipulate time. Manipulate time? Yes, if you press this, you can temporarily manipulate time. Should give you some time to dodge attacks. Of course, you need to be quick. This is all the help I can give right now. I hope we won't, won't be saying our final goodbyes. Goodbye to... No. See you again, eternity! Ha! <laughs> ha! 
Yeah, we Okay. Can't just run away now. Not after getting this far. All right, let's deal with this. I just started playing a space shooter. Oh, nice. I can hold it. Oh, it has segments. Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> wow, I feel like I just played this earlier. Cult of the Lamb, is that you? Shit. Thought you said I could maintain my oxygen levels. Whew, okay. Oh, man, that would have been appropriate for Duff. I wish he would have. Our current attack level might not be enough. This enemy's tougher than we expected. I didn't want to go this far, but let's unlock the limiter. Why didn't she do that from the start? Who brings out their trump card right at the beginning of a game? Just watch this. I call this Stella Laser. A super-powered laser combining all our tech. Never thought we'd use it underwater. Hmm. Okay. Pay attention. If you hold X, you can gather Stella energy. Let go of the button to fire. Easy, right? But keep in mind you'll move slower while charging, so be careful. Good luck, Dave. A charge and fire laser, huh? Great, let's finish with this. Okay, stopping time is very nice. I need to not get distracted. Okay. Holy shit. Okay. We're back. No, gosh darn it. We're back at the beginning. Oh, damn. I've got so much more oxygen now. This will be better. I can dodge stuff for sure. Got distracted. Okay. Yeah, the Matrix slow mo is super helpful here. Okay, yep, 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 yep. Got it, got it, got it, got it. All right. Very nice. Okay. 
And then I need to get the fuck out of the way. Oh my god, how strong are you? Like legit, how strong are you? What is this? All right, I can't charge in between these. That's a given. All right, I see you coming back at me. That's not it. Surely, surely that's not it. Am I the one? I don't think so. I think I just pissed it off. I thought I was supposed to kill it. Oh, it's trying to run away. If we don't kill it now, it'll continue to cause problems. Let's put an end to this once and for all. Ooh, chase scene and a shooter? I get the feeling that's what's happening. Yeah, we're in a bullet hell now. Oh boy. Dick. Whew. thing is so strong damn okay i need to just dodge when that happens it's easily telegraphed oh did i just have to follow it all the way oh seems like it's finally tired Now's our chance, Dave. We need to end. Oh, shit. Don't even think about it. Ah! Oh, that was close. Looks like it's using its last bit of strength. Dave, move to that open path for now. I won't be able to hold on much longer. Are you sure about that? I think I'm the one being chased now. There we 
go. <sighs> Luring. <laughs> sure feels like being chased to me. Shrimpzilla. It's a dead end. What should I do? We dodge. That's what we do. Oh, shit. Fuck. I hit the wrong button. Oh, thank God they don't make me do it all over again. They are so forgiving in this game. All right, which button do I need to push? Z-A-B-Y, Z-A-B-Y, Z-A-B-Y. B. There we go. A. I'm so used to Nintendo controllers, even now. Huh, that creature's tangled into the vine tree. This is a lucky opportunity to finish it off. Hmm, the sea drone seems to be malf- or the drone seems to be malfunctioning. I can't pick up the weapon signal. Well, what should I do? Is there anything useful around here? Maybe some explodey fruit? Oh, there is a huge divine tree fruit device over there. The divine tree fruit, fruit tree fruit seems to have returned to normal. What if I put it in there and operate it? No, oh, it's too big. I can't possibly move and aim it all by myself. Hey, they're finally doing stuff. Are you all right, human? Oh, sea people. We came down here because you didn't come up even though the divine tree was stabilized. Is that Yawye? Has it grown that big over this long period of time? It seems like we need to defeat that creature to end this. This is our chance while it's tied up. Let's finish it off. That won't be enough unless we use the divine tree for device over there. Well, given my expertise in both physics and math, it seems like we might need to adjust the angle of the device upwards. Well, that might work, but it looks incredibly heavy. We'll help. If five of us combine our strengths, we can do it somehow. You bring the divine tree fruit and put it in. There's no time. I can do that. All right. Let me at the fruit. Let me at the fruit. I got this. Hi, Sir Doggo. I hear him snuffing. Come on. Got it. This is basically, I think, just uh, ending cutscene stuff. All right, I'm ready. The device is responding. It's time to end our long history. You pesky nuisance, take this. That's a dead bug. Ew. My aim was precise. Won't recover from that state. <sighs> this really has been an incredible journey. You did a great job, human. Let's go back to the Sea People Village and talk. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna eat him. G give me his ingredients. Oh, Wins fatality. Burn, baby, burn. Disco Inferno. Water temperature has stabilized and the divine tree fruit is also in good condition. The villagers who were ill seem to be slowly improving. We've faced many challenges, but it's a relief that we've managed to overcome them. I think the earthquakes on the mainland will stop as well. How about going up and checking the status? Good job, human. Come and visit us often. Yay! We beat another game! Yay! Epilogue. Friends. Oh. Right, I caught a narwhal before we got... <laughs> I caught a narwhal before we did all that. 
And I got Megalograptus. Hmm. <laughs> Wrap up your day and get things ready at Boncho Sushi. It's already nighttime? It's been a long day. I think I'll drop by Boncho Sushi. I don't... Let me check my phone! He's not even letting me check my phone. He's just like, all right, we gotta go. <laughs> We're going now. Thank you, everybody. Oh, look at all our friends. I still never got to feed the cat. Hey there, Dave, you're finally back. Oh, everyone's gathered here? We heard from Dr. Bacon. You've accomplished a lot. You did a good job. How about we all relax today and enjoy some food together? Oh, awesome. I was afraid I might... I was worried I might have to get right back to work. Great. We should all celebrate together. <coughs> Let me feed her! Him! Let me give him the cat food! I've got so much of it! It's been a while. Boncho Sushi. How are you, Sammy? Are you enjoying your life here? You know it. There are times when I get a bit bored, but it's also incredibly inspiring, yo. Yeah. The new song I released recently, Farmer Daddy Online. How's <laughs> it getting great feedback, you know? <laughs> Farmer Daddy. I need to hear it. So you're still making music, huh? For sure. The sound of a hoe hitting the ground, the clucking of a hen. It's all just one big beat to me, yo. Why didn't he come in person? Because I am waiting for an important parcel today. I've been inspired from afar by your bravery, Dave. The way you fought tirelessly to save the Sea People Village. If you were a beautiful girl, I might have joined your fandom. I'll pour all my energy into weapon research to prepare for any upcoming crises. As your colleague, I'm counting on your continued efforts, Dave. Hmm. All right. Oh, dear. <laughs> a true feast. You're always so busy, we've hardly had the time to chat. Now that things are calmer, I'll have plenty of time to share my stories. Share with you some more of my stories. Um, sir? Back in my diving days, I was mostly into free diving. And I wore the necklace my father gave me. The barracudas have a tendency to attack anything that shines. Out of nowhere, a school of barracudas came at me. Even worse, I didn't have a harpoon that day. Figured fleeing might be more dangerous. So I swam right at the barracudas. Oh, I think the ground just shook. Huh, eh? I didn't feel anything. <laughs> Dave, you've worked really hard. It's gratifying to see your venture prospering. That's largely thanks to you for providing such reliable staff. You must have had your plate full with all kinds of things. But now, I hope you can support Boncho in running the restaurant effectively. Boncho's a bit stubborn and might stir up some problems if left to his own devices. Hey, Dave, your assistance has really helped elevate my status at the company. We have a new reporter now, which lightens my load a bit, so I can even afford to join in these evening gatherings. Since I cannot drink beer, I stick to non-alcoholic drinks, though. <laughs> Glad to hear that I was helpful. So you don't need me to help with the reporting anymore, right? What are you talking about? I still don't know how to dive. <laughs> if there's anything I need help with, I'll come looking for you. Damn right you will. I'll happily photograph that pot of dolphins that I totally missed earlier. Good job, Dave. I opened up a shop here because this place has plenty of fish. Who knew it had such a secret? Well, you solved the problem and my business is booming now. Guess my decision was right after all. <laughs> it was a fun experience. Coming here was a good idea. I'm thinking about seeking out another adventure. What do you think? Let's just rest for now, Cobra. Agreed. First time seeing you in the shop, huh? Well, I just finished submitting my paper, so I'm a bit free. Good, I'm glad for you. Hmm, that ego bag there. Haven't seen it before. <laughs> you have sharp eyes. It's the reward for maxing out the Eco Watcher level. It's a service that prints out the faces of users committed to environmental protection on a bag. You've really been putting a lot of work in since you got some free time. I can't fall behind. I don't remember what voice I had for this guy. Sato, you made it too? Wait, he's got like a ro low, like, or, 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 I don't think I can do that. 
Heard you'd been venturing into glaciers to collect Marinka, and I thought I'd show some support. Well, that's not quite true, but... Hmm, thanks to you, my world ranking keeps getting better and better. Now that the big event is behind us, let's see about gathering the remaining Marinka. Oops, just remembered. Forgot to turn the lights off. Off the lights after a GYAO went to sleep. Gow? The fuck is Gow? Hey, wouldn't you have your face on a tote bag if you were devoted to environmental protection? Still can't believe what happened. Not just the Sea People civilization, but the village too. You even solved their crisis. Good job. From now on, we should keep the civilization secret. They need to maintain the peace they've regained. You know who isn't here? John Watson, because he got eaten by a dinosaur. <laughs> oh, Vincent, are you here alone again? Are you here alone tonight? I didn't come here to rate your restaurant today, so don't stress. Take it easy. When I dine in peace, I savor the... I can savor the intricate flavors more. It's delicious. I'm happy to hear that. Hmm, I guess my prejudices have worn off, but there's no denying that there has been a slight change to the taste. Really? The taste changed? It's a bit smoother. You could say it's softer. Before, the dishes were brimming with the chef's strong-willed style, but now it feels more accommodating to the consumer. Interesting. So that translates into the taste as well. Well, that might just be my perception. I'm sorry I couldn't be of much help. I was busy with the shop. What are you talking about, Boncho? The sea people loved your cooking. Hmm. If that's the case, I'm glad. Now there are no more earthquakes, let's get to work. Whew, it was a lot tougher than I thought, but... I met a lot of nice people in the end. Looking back, it was a fun adventure. Never would have visited a place like the Sea People Village in my life were I not given the opportunity. Okay, let's relax and go for another exciting dive. Oh, and they all party. Cheers. <laughs> Duff lurking like a ghost in the background. Oh, they have the inspiring, like, the inspiring music. Oh, <laughs> so I'm being scared as usual. Oh, God, pizza sounds really good right now. Oh, new figurine. Ah, we get a statue? Oh! Good for Maki! <laughs> oh! Yes! Feed the kitty! Right, Dave, get some sleep. I had a lot of fun with this game. More than I realized I would. I didn't realize it had a story like this when my friend got it for me. He was like, you will enjoy this, play it. I was like, okay. And he was right. Cobra, what did you do? What the fuck? Is this, this is a dream, right? Oh, wait. Wait. How do I... Wait, am I in control of the... Wait, 
How do I how do I shoot things? Oh. Wait. Oh. I guess we're fighting aliens now. <laughs> Poor little aliens. Yet again, humans ruin everything. <laughs> ship go where did my where did my ships go come back i need more i need more i need more aliens to kill come on aha i see you down there you thought you could escape ow the devs did do a good job on this like I could tell that the translation team there there were some parts of dialogue that were a bit clunky but like they did a really really good job oh no more names gonna watch the cult of the lamb finale that you missed during the whole flight fiasco fiasco was it not did something happen I know that travel mishaps are not uncommon I've had a few myself where things just did not go well. And that is why I will never ride Greyhound again. If I can help it. If left, if left to my choice and it is not the only option, I will take other methods of transportation that are not the bus. Like trains. Trains are good. Oh, and me. Ah, oh, man, I wanted a thousand. Whoa. Well, there went my ship. I found it. <laughs> Thank you, Abaddon. Flight was supposed to be leave at 9.30. Got delayed twice to 10.37, but it left at that time. Okay, that that wasn't as bad as I thought it might have been. <laughs> yeah, that was cute. Yay, we beat the game. Now we get to go kill everything that we want. Oh. A peaceful blue hole watched the ending credits. Did you sleep well, Dave? Yeah, finally got some sound sleep. Even dreamed I was exploring space. <laughs> Things should calm down a bit now. Well then, check on any unfinished business. Let's have a blast running Boncho Sushi. Hmm, the fishmon this week is detected by the radar is... What's this? A jellyfish with some kind of wizard hat? That can't be a real jellyfish. Goodness, do you doubt the accuracy of our fish radar? It's a very difficult task detecting this jellyfish with our radar. The reason was this jellyfish teleports around at incredible speeds. It'll disappear as soon as you go near. You probably won't be able to catch it unless you have something like a sniper rifle. About 100 meters underwater, near the yellow shipwreck. That's what my information says. Mm -hmm. Now then, keep up the good work this week. Hmm, a jellyfish that teleports. That's kind of interesting, I suppose. The minigame Space Diver. Huh. All right, that's the main game, though. And I gotta get some sleep. 
I gotta try and I gotta try and get my schedule in order. <sighs> I have to. Because pretty soon I won't be able to go for like four to six hours. So I think. Oh no. I'm sorry, Abby. We did do it though. It was scary. Um, but I'm not going to be able to linger. So go show any of the streamers that we usually raid some love. I'm sure there are some still on. It's pretty early. Yumeko is about to come on, I'm pretty sure. So show people some love and have a wonderful night. I'm going to go eat. And I'm really glad that uh, aside from a small hiccup, OBS seemed to work pretty well. So, yeah. <laughs> Yay, but LOL, have a good night. And to you is also live. Yeah, go show people some love. I'm gonna go. I already actually got ready for bed, washed my face, brushed my teeth before I even started stream so that I could just go to bed. All right. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you for joining me. Two new games next week because we beat two this week. Let's go. All right. Have a good night.